Ladies and gentlemen, it's my honor to introduce the F-15EX Eagle II! The U.S. Air Force is one of the deadliest military might in the world. It has the F-22 Raptor and the F-35 Lightning II planes. Its fleet will soon be filled with newly baptized F-15 EX Eagle II warplanes. In fact, the Air Force recently took delivery of the second F-15 EX fighter aircraft from a consortium led by Boeing. The F-15 EX is a 4.5 generation aircraft with capabilities far more advanced than other fourth-generation fighters in the U.S. Air Force, as made possible by its advanced cockpit and open mission systems, fly-by-wire flight controls, new electronic warfare system, new sensors, as well as additional wing hardpoints. It can easily adapt to new weapons and technologies and carry over three times more payload than an F-35 thus, making it a bomb truck for future engagements. Since the U.S. Air Force already has the F-15 infrastructure, only minimal transitional training and development is needed. The biggest differences between the cost-effective F-15EX and older F-15s are engines, flight controls, and displays. The F-15 Eagle II incorporates a number of upgrades over its predecessor models and is based on Boeing's most advanced F-15 models currently being produced for KIDR while also maintaining 70% parts commonality with existing F-15s. Like its counterpart in the F-16 Fighting Falcon, the fourth-generation F-15 Eagle has been a mainstay of the United States Air Force's fighter fleet since its introduction to operation service in the 1970s. For decades, the F-15 formed the core of the Air Force's air superiority mission, and while the title of the world's premier air superiority fighter may have been usurped by more advanced fifth-generation aircraft, such as the F-22 Raptor, the Eagle has a long and proud service record, boasting an unprecedented air-to-air -air combat record of 104 confirmed kills to zero. F-15 EX Weapon One of the F-15 EX key features is a large weapons carriage and the capability to carry hypersonic weapons. Raytheon Missiles and Defense is equipping the F-15 EX with three weapons that complement one another. The AIM-9X Sidewinder Missile is a shorter-range air-to-air missile that uses infrared instead of radar to detect, track, and guide to a target. The F-15 EX can carry up to six AIM-9X missiles on its wings. The newest version of the Amron missile can detect, target, and engage enemy aircraft at distances well beyond visual range. And it has GPS-aided navigation and a two-way data link. The F-15EX can be armed with up to 12 Amron missiles. The Stormbreaker smart weapon can see through fog, smoke, and rain as it glides over four to five miles to strike a moving target. Depending on the mission, the Eagle II can carry more than 16 Stormbreaker weapons. In 2020, the Air Force cleared the system for use on the F-15 E-Strike Eagle, making it the first aircraft to carry the new weapon. F-15 EX Radar Raytheon Intelligence in Space, a Raytheon Technologies business, will integrate its APG-82V1 active electronically scanned array radar into the F-15EX. The modernized radar can detect, identify, and track multiple air and surface targets at the same time and at longer ranges than ever before. It's the latest radar advancement for the F-15E fleet. More affordable than F-35 the U.S. Air Force doesn't want to purchase new F-35 aircraft since transitioning to a different airframe 
and replacing existing air combat infrastructure would be costly and time-consuming. By foregoing an F-35 purchase and pursuing F-15EX acquisitions, the Air Force estimates savings of around $3 billion over its five-year future year's defense program. The U.S. Air Force sees the F-15EX purchase as the fastest way to refresh its capacity, update its capabilities, and improve readiness. Still not a stealthy fifth-generation aircraft. At its best, the F-15EX is a 4.5-generation aircraft, as it lacks the stealthy nature and sensor fusion characteristics of fifth-generation aircraft like the F-35 that would allow it to evade modern air defenses. However, it boasts a large weapons payload capacity thrice that of an F-35. F-15 EX engine Pratt & Whitney, a Raytheon Technologies business, has powered every operational F-15 in the U.S. Air Force fleet for more than 40 years. It has submitted a proposal for its F-100 PW-229 engine to power future lots of the F-15EX. This engine also powers many U.S. Air Force Strike Eagles and uses that technology to enable a multi-role air-to-ground fighter. F-15 made its debut in 1974. The F-15 Eagle was first used by the Air Force in 1974 its successor being the 1989 F-15E Strike Eagle. Since the development of the F-15E, the craft has evolved to include digital fly-by-wire controls, Suite 9 avionics, new cockpit displays, and an advanced display core processor too, a technology that made its debut in 2016. The U.S. Air Force received the F-15EX on March 10, 2021. Newer F-15s also incorporate the Eagle Passive Active Warning Survivability System, which, according to developer BAE Systems, provides advanced aircraft protection and situational awareness to protect F-15EX and F-15E aircraft. 